bores you. Bores you! Christ the Almighty, try working for you for a living! The talking, 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 Jesus Christ, don't want to ever shut up! Titanic self-absorption of a man! You will stand there trying to look so deep when you're nothing but a, a solipsistic bully with your grandiose self-importance and lectures and rise and, and let's look at the fucking canvas for another few weeks now. Let's not fucking paint. Let's just look. You know, not everything has to rape your guts out and expose your soul. Not everyone wants art that actually hurts. <laughs> Sometimes you just want a, a fucking still life, or, or a landscape, or, or a comic book, or a soup can. Which you might learn if you left this goddamn hermetically sealed submarine room here with all the windows closed and no natural light, because natural light isn't good enough for you. Well, then again, nothing is good enough for you, is it? Not even the people who buy your paintings? Museums are nothing but museums, and, and galleries are run by pimps and swindlers, and, and, and art collectors are nothing but shallow social climbers. So who is good enough to own your art, huh? Anyone? Oh, or maybe the real question is who is good enough to even see your art? Is it just possible that none of us are worthy to look at your paintings? That's it, isn't it? We've all been hung in the balance and have been found wanting. You say you spend your whole life in search of real human beings, people who can look at your art with compassion. But in your heart, you no longer believe these people exist, so you lose faith. So you lose hope. So black swallows red. Oh, my friend, I don't think you'd recognize a real human being if you were standing right in front of you. Never mind. <laughs>